We begin tonight with two local towns that sit right next to each other, each living under a totally different set of rules. We're talking about Folsom in Sacramento County and El Dorado Hills in El Dorado County. Yeah, the two towns, while close in proximity, are far apart on the state's reopening plan. Sacramento still sits in the most restrictive purple tier, while El Dorado County once again moved up in the system from red to orange, allowing for a whole host of new businesses to reopen. CBS 13's Valina Jones is live with the tale of two very different business scenes, Valina. That's right. You know, people here in El Dorado County tell me they're finally feeling some sense of normalcy. Just a couple of hours ago, this area was packed with people. While not even three miles away, residents in Folsom are driving over the hill to get a piece of the action. It's just busy everywhere. With busy shopping malls, more people around, and open movie theaters. Shawnee Thompson, who works at Tan Central, says it looks like business as usual for El Dorado County. It's amazing to start opening back up and and getting back to some kind of normal. The county now in the orange tier is allowed to loosen restrictions, allowing for indoor dining, outside bars, and increased capacity at gyms like Orange Theory at the El Dorado Town Center. Those same things are closed just two and a half miles away in Sacramento County at Palladio, still in the most restricted category. It's just it's been very difficult since Folsom closed, made it very difficult to get into our normal spots here. Members at the gym say people are crossing county lines just to get some extra freedom. So now we go to El Dorado Hills as much as we can. It's pretty full. It's the only one open, so everybody kind of gets in. We have to wait sometimes, but it's worth it. As El Dorado County sees looser restrictions, county health doctor Nancy Williams is warning to not get complacent. Just because something's open or allowed does not mean it's inherently safe and that we still need to be really careful about um, about doing the precautions. Jim Arellano in Folsom lives just a block away from the El Dorado County line. It's not like we're talking, you know, <laughs> California and Texas here. It's, <laughs> we're talking just down the street. He believes those couple of feet shouldn't make a difference for what he has access to. The counties need to break it up by saying cities, you know, in, in towns. Now, Dr. Williams tells me she is confident in these new looser restrictions. She just wants people to take precautions. She says the next couple of weeks will be very telling to see if the county can sustain their numbers and eventually get into the lowest tier.